Remember a time before living in that laboratory. That fateful night started like any other. Sax gave us our injections. Your father made sure our vital signs were strong. And you, as always, provided us with a special treat. After the brothers went to sleep, I heard loud voices. There was the smell of smoke. Alarms sounded. Your father had discovered the truth behind the man he was working for. He set fire to the lab. His last breath was taken, trying to destroy Shredder's plan. I was terrified, but then you appeared. And ushered us to safety. I never had a voice then. But I thank you now, April. Hmm. We wandered the sewers until I found this place. It was then that the mutagen that was injected into our blood began to change us in miraculous ways. I saw how your father loved you, and I knew I had to show that same love to the turtles. I became their father, and they became my sons. Like all children, they were drawn to the distractions of popular culture. And I knew one day they would want to explore the world above. They would be ridiculed. Oh. They would need to learn to protect themselves, both mentally and physically. Hey, does anyone want to play Buck Buck? Buck one, Buck two, Buck three. <laughs> Where you going, Rand? Come on, I can't play by myself. I need all four. Yeah, that sounds stupid. Like you, Mikey. Yeah, well, that's not the point. Yeah, that's not And then I found a way. First, I would teach myself the ancient art of ninjutsu. <laughs> the brothers followed my lead, accelerating at a wondrous rate. Their gift was also their passion. They lived, breathed, and dreamed all things martial arts. <laughs> then they were ready. The katana, most noble of all the blades. It is the weapon of a leader. Everything they are and everything that they've become was made possible by the bravery that you displayed on that fateful night. Dude. I was just a little girl. And you gave us freedom, where others would have kept us in cages. Wait a minute, Dad. All these years you told us we were rescued from the fire by a great guardian spirit, a Hogosha. That's right. And this is the Hogosha. What? Friends, totally the Hogo Shah. Fortunately, our engineers have been making great progress in refining the robotics in your armor. We're taking it to the next level. 
Bridging the gap between ancient tradition and modern warfare. Why did you bring me here? To find out who you told of our existence. Nobody that believed me, except for Eric Sachs. Sachs. Just as I feared. Sachs is not a friend. His soul has been poisoned by the influence of a dark master. The Shredder. Shredder practically raised Sax in Japan. He's like a father to him. Sax will do anything for his master. <laughs> 